What's going on, JRD Nation? Today, we're gonna do a workout to help you burn the most calories possible in 30 minutes. What's going on, guys? I'm Brandon Epstein. We are the Jump Rope Dudes, and as always, we're here to help you jump rope, get lean, and live more. So we have this idea for a workout where we wanted to see what is the max calorie burn we can do in 30 minutes while also not killing ourselves because of course we could just jump rope for 30 minutes straight. We're not doing that today. We are gonna have some intervals, but we wanna maximize our calorie burn. And so how are we gonna measure this first of all? People ask us that all the time. We're gonna be measuring it with the Whoop. This is a wearable that we have, we've been using for the last eight or nine months or so that we like a lot. So now we are sharing it with you guys. So this Whoop is a fitness tracker that's pretty cool because it tracks your calories, the strain you're putting on your body, and most importantly, your recovery. Because if you're not recovering, you're not gonna be able to get those gains. So if you guys are interested in picking up one of these Whoops, once you click that link in the description below, you have to enter code Jump Rope Dudes, or you will not get the discount and they will not know that you're coming from our community. So make sure that when you click that link below, if you're interested in learning more about the Whoop, when you check out, you enter the code Jump Rope Dudes. And in addition to you know us getting credit for sharing this with you, you're also gonna get $30 off your order, which is pretty cool as well. Um, final thing I'll say about the Whoop is that the main reason we partnered with them is because we found out we could create a Jump Rope Dudes team and leaderboard, meaning you could compare yourself to me and Dan and the other Jump Rope Dude fitness community members and see you know, how hard you're going on a daily basis versus other people and just kind of see how you stack up and you could really see what your training regimen looks like compared to ours. So we thought that was pretty cool. So that's a feature that you have access to as well. So if you do get the Whoop, just uh, you can add yourself to our team by also entering the code jump rope. All right, that's it for the whoop. Sorry, there's a lot of talking before this video today. There's some important things we do want to share with you guys. The last thing I want to share is that we're going to be using the one pound cross rope throughout this workout. Why are we using one pound cross rope? Because this is a rope that we can move fast enough to make it a high intensity workout but it's also a rope that is heavy enough that's gonna add a lot of resistance to our body and help us maximize our calorie burn. So if you would like this one pound rope, it's also linked up in the description below. And this is a special bundle they made available for you guys that includes our limited edition Jump Rope Dude handles and just the one pound rope. So you're not gonna see this offer anywhere else on the Cross Rope site. They usually just do the Get Lean, Get Fit, and the Get Strong bundles, but this is different. This is just these limited edition Jump Rope Dude handles and the one pound rope. And so since this is a special deal, you're gonna get $30 off your order if you pick that up. It's linked up in the description below. Now, let's get into the workout. All right, it's just about time to get into this workout. I wanna cover a couple things because I know I'm throwing a lot of stuff at you during this workout. This new whoop, the one pound rope, and what these intervals are gonna look like. So let me just cover this one more time real quick. So by now, I hope you've already done a warm up because I'm gonna get right into this workout. So if you need to do a little warm up, do it because in this workout, I'm not gonna be giving you a warm up. So pause the video now if you need to do that. And then in regards to utilizing this Whoop to record your workout, make sure that you open up the app and then you go to the functional fitness section and then you hit start activity there. They don't have jump rope yet, Maybe they will in the future, we hope they do. So record it as a functional fitness exercise and then you're gonna be able to compare your calorie burn versus ours. So that's all I wanted to say about that. Um, I'm also gonna be listening to our Spotify playlist to give me some extra energy. I usually don't do this, but I wanna see if I can max out the calorie burn. So listening to good music helps with that. And you guys get the music through YouTube, but I don't, you know, I'm just out here in the parking lot. So I put my headphones in so I can listen to some music as well. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna use the one pound cross rope for all of these different sets. We're gonna do 30 seconds with the one pound cross rope, 10 seconds rest. We're gonna do that 14 times total. Then we're gonna take a one minute rest, all right? We're gonna do that three times total and that will be a total of 30 minutes. So let's see how many calories we can burn together in the next 30 minutes. Let's do the thing in three, two, one. Here we go. So I'm gonna start with the jump rope regular bounce keep it nice and simple and we can mix it up a little bit later in the workout. We'll just get in our rhythm now. Have fun with this. Of course there's going to be some pain involved because we're going super hard. But see how hard you can go for the next 30 minutes. Let's go. Whew. So 
doors are already burning. Shake it out, shake it out. We got this 10 second rest. Get yourself ready to go. All right, I'm gonna incorporate some run in place now. Just follow along with me. Let's see what we can do here. If you wanna throw in some tricks here and there, you're more than welcome to. Sometimes make the workout, makes the workouts a little more fun. Great work. Oh man, what I get myself into. You guys feeling that shoulder burn? Woo! No pain, no gain, right? Here we go. Let's do a little fast skip. And you can really freestyle, or you can follow along with me. Do what you gotta do to keep this rope moving. Great work. Here we go. Next set. I'm also utilizing this uh, cross rope mat here. Save the rope a little bit. Make the, the rope life a little bit longer. Three, two, one. Here we go, back into it. So utilizing a heavy rope like this alone is gonna get your calorie burn up big time. If you have a regular rope, that's cool too, but uh, you're not gonna be able to get the kind of results you would get if you're using a heavy rope. We doing good? Let's keep it going, come on. Here we go, push yourself. It's all mental. You're capable of pushing yourself as hard as you want. It's just, it's up to you to decide how hard you wanna go. Come on. It's all a mental game. Push yourself, move through that pain. Whew. Almost halfway done with this first round. Begin. The reason why we love this one pound too is because you really can do a lot of tricks with it. <laughs> so it makes it work out so hard. Here we go. Shake it out, shake it out. Keep the intensity up, here we go. It's also how you Work those shoulders really good as well. Putting the resistance of the rope on these uh, shoulder boulders. Two, one, time. You guys are doing great. Stick with me, all right? You got this. It's just 30 minutes total.
Use your breath. Keep yourself poised under control. Slow that breath down. Here we go. There you go, you got this. Three, two, one. Let's go. We're almost done with this first round and you get a one minute rest. I would say that probably the run in place or the high knees some of the best exercises for burning lots of calories. So you can follow along with me or you could go even harder than me. <laughs> and when I'm doing other tricks, you can just keep on grinding through that run in place. Couple more sets, then we get that rest. And the goal here is to keep challenging yourself to spin this rope as fast as you can. It's gonna burn, you're gonna wanna slow down. You gotta push through by Tell your mind that your body can do it, and your body will follow. our last set and then we get a one minute rest let's finish strong here last 30 seconds before our big rest let's get those knees up Five, four, three, two, one. Here we go, y'all. Round number two of three. Let's get after it. Let me see you whip that rope. Come on. Let's just start off with some regular bounce. It's like these tiny little hops and balls your feet. Three, two, 
one. My Mac keeps slipping back. One power rope is just so powerful, you know? Here we go. Right in place. If you need to, close your eyes. Just move through that pain, come on. Skip, a little side slide. Three, two, one, rest. Back to it. Again, you can follow along with me or do whatever you want. All I care about is you're going intense. See how you match up. Me in this workout. Two. Shake your arms out. Everybody is here in LA on vacation, so a lot of people here doing the beach while getting this working. <laughs> here we go, run in place. And get those knees up. comes the sweat. Two, one, rest. It's the beautiful thing about jump rope. We get a super intense workout in 30 minutes and we're done. That's all it takes. Especially with these heavy ropes. Guys, push yourself. You got this. We're almost halfway done with this set right here. And actually the whole workout, technically. Beautiful. See how hard you can push yourself. Let's go. Every set, it's an opportunity to push a little bit harder. Here's some little toe taps. You bring those in a little bit. 
alternating some new movements. Great job. Shake it out, shake it out, shake it out. All right, let's go. On to the next. At this point, do whatever you gotta do to keep that room moving. That's all I care about. Just keep it going. Two, one. Sprint it out. Keep that core nice and tight. Turn all this movement. And keep that posture nice and vertical. Let's go, we're almost done with this round. Round number two, almost. Come on, dig down deep and push yourself. Three, two, one. Got two more sets and we get a minute rest. Let's push ourselves as far as we can. The last two. Start with regular bounce. Save your shoulders a little bit if you know how to crisscross. Do like four or five regular bounces as fast as you can. And throw a crisscross in just so you can keep it moving. Three, two, one. All right, so last set. Then we get a minute rest, so you know what that means. Everything you got, let's go. Let's go high knees. Those knees up, come on, all the way through. Last five seconds. Three, two, one. Set, last round, sorry, now I said last round, and we're out of here. Let's go. Finish strong. Let's start with the regular rounds.
here we go. Set two, run in place. Sprint it out, come on. Let's go. Still a little feet in and out. Push up a little bit. Right back into it. Whatever you can do, just keep that rope moving as fast as you can. Just get in your zone. It's just you in the present moment. Doing the best you can, come on. Go, keep it going. Keep that rope moving, whatever it takes. Come on. Yep, shake out those arms. This is it. Final stretch, come on. Dig down deep. Let's see what we can accomplish here. I think the hardest part of this might be just the, the shoulder workout you get, which is insane with this one power rope using it every single step. Keep that going. Spin that rope as fast as you can. Three, two, one, rest. Halfway done with this final round. Finish strong. Three, two, one. Shake it out, shake it out. We're almost there.
go. Finish strong. Whatever you need to do, a regular bounce, run in place, crisscross. Let's just get you through the finish line. Come on. We're almost out of 30 minutes. I'm gonna go high knees. I'm trying to see how much I can burn in these 30 minutes. Let's go. sets. everything we have come on we're done for the day after this come on dig down deep push yourself she says before but keep your shoulder blades back and together as much as you can that's how you bring your back into this workout especially with the head girls three Two, one. It's our final set. Let's go. Tiny hops, fast as you can. How you feeling after that? Woo. All right, I'm gonna end my workout on the whoop. So I went uh, 32 minutes total, but it's because I was talking to you guys in the beginning a little bit. So the cool thing about these workouts is at the end, you say your perceived exertion out of like 21. Mine was probably, I would say 14 out of 21. It's not that I couldn't have gone harder. It's just that like with the one pound rope, it's mostly just a matter of like, your shoulders get too fatigued, so like you physically can't go faster. So uh, give that a 14 performance level. I was happy, five out of five. And I was able to complete it. So in a moment here, this is gonna give me basically a uh, picture of what my workout looked like, my heart rate, total calories burned, stuff like that. Mr. Uh, Mr. Evo, please put that up on the screen right now so people can see how my workout went and you can compare your workout against my workout. Thank you guys so much for watching the video today, doing the workout, doing the thing. If you enjoyed the workout, please subscribe to the channel, like the video, drop any comments you have below. Pick up that jump rope and the whoop in the description below. As always, do the thing.